Yo, another day, another dollar with your homeboy Jermaine and getting this vlog started off. Lunchtime, the idea today is to, you know, knock out a few deliveries on the dinner rush and then I'm gonna have to head over to the East Bay because I have a few errands to run over there. It's not gonna be like, probably not gonna work as much today. Maybe I'll chill more than I work today, but I also gotta knock out a few errands too, so I don't know, let's get this video started. All right, come on, who put these garbage cans in the street? Now I can't go right. I have to wait till this car goes left and then I can go right. Just picking up this first order and it's like a box of donuts, like super easy, super easy to transport. I won't have to worry about like spilling soup or anything like that. This one's going all the way downtown in the financial district. Cross my fingers, I can, you know, grab something in the financial district that's leaving the financial district because, uh, I don't know, lately I've just been kinda I don't know, just avoiding the financial district. Traffic's picking up big time because today's a nice sunny day. All right, I'm on the second delivery right now. This delivery just sucked from the get-go. Like, the restaurant took forever. And then it took me forever to find a parking spot because there was a couple meter maids riding, driving around. And I pretty much had to park in the street. And I don't know. I think it's just a matter of time before I'm, like, cutting the caviar app off. Man, one thing that just ticks me off about caviar, like I, when I was at the restaurant, I waited about 25 minutes, and usually they don't pay like anything for restaurant delays. They always say that they they pay out, but it's it's so low that it's not even worth it. So the payout, I checked out, I checked the payout, and I got 37 cents for waiting there. Can you guys guess the weather? This guy has a jacket on. This other guy doesn't. Is it hot or cold? Just dropped this last order off, and I was gonna, you know, take it easy, but this next request just popped up. It's from a popular restaurant that I, yeah, I don't know, I usually like to go to because there's some, some pretty cute girls working there. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna roll over to this restaurant, scoop up this order really fast, drop it off. At least I'm getting 10 bucks from this order. And after that, I'm gonna look for something to eat, and Maybe I'll head over to the East Bay. Hopefully traffic is not bad going to the East Bay. And more importantly, ho hopefully traffic's not bad coming back from the East Bay. Nice, just dropped that order off and uh, I was actually able to find a decent parking spot. I dropped two quarters in the meter and uh, I think I'm gonna go hit up this Mediterranean spot right down here really fast, grab a bite to eat and then rush over to the East Bay. I definitely don't miss this traffic on the bridge. I've been, what, I'm sitting in traffic for about 25 minutes so far, and I haven't yet hit the bridge. Leaving Oakland now, just gassed up on some of that low price Oakland gas, about to hit the bridge, go back to the city, and uh, I was able to knock out a cell phone repair, so that was pretty cool. And yeah, let's get ready to cross this bridge, and um, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll go online for a little bit. But I believe later I'm gonna go out and maybe catch happy hour um, and meet up with a friend if they're still down. No traffic going to the city. And look at those clouds. Beautiful out. Back in the city now and I'm trying to figure out where's all the traffic. Usually Montgomery Street is just full of cars and I can see straight down in Montgomery right now. Just picked up another order. Now this is an order from one of those like fancy organic shops. And when I went inside, they had vegan chocolate chip cookies. I was able to get me one of these huge yummy chocolate chip cookies. Can't wait to tear into this one and see what it's all about. Mmm. Mmm. All right, just ditched the car, and now I'm gonna go roam around the city while there's a little bit of daylight left. A little bit of daylight left. One thing about having the car, a lot of times it it's really tricky to park in certain places. It's like $6 or $12 or $3 an hour to park. So of course I don't want to do that. And so I was able to find like a, one of those parking spots where, you know, you can park for like three days in a row and you don't need a permit and you don't have to do any street sweeping and all that. I don't need a parking spot for three days. I'll just probably pick it up tomorrow. I think I said tomorrow, I'm totally thinking about returning the rental car because I mean, I've had it for four weeks and every four weeks you have to return it, but there's always that option to, you know, get another rental car once you return that one. I think I'm gonna hang out for like a week or two without a rental car and I'll see how that goes. One, one problem I always have with rental cars, whenever I rent a rental car, it seems like the weather is like nice all of a sudden. 
and I'm thinking about getting rid of the rental car and there's like all this rain in the forecast but I think I'm just gonna like take off on those rainy days and just don't trip just you know do my thing anyway regardless of the weather Yo, let me fill you guys in right now. So, I just left the bar. Happy hour was a lot of fun, a lot of fun. I was checking the TaskRabbit app, and this very, very simple job popped up. Go down to the Apple Store, buy this Apple charger for a computer, and take it three blocks from the Apple Store and drop it off with the front desk or whatever, and it's 28 bucks. I'm totally down to do that for $28. Off to the Apple Store now to uh, buy a charger, and then I'm gonna drop it off at the front desk and uh, collect that 28 bucks. Get reimbursed later. I don't mind. That, that's what's up. I love it. 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 In the Apple store now, I'm looking for this charger. And dang, dude, I'm so tempted to get these. You know, these lights where you can control with your phone. But I, I think that's a little weird. Like, say you can control with your phone. What do you guys think? Do you think that's really weird? I see you can control with your phone, question mark, question mark, question mark. All right, here it is. This is the one right here. All right, got the charger. Let's uh, go drop this one off real quick. All right, what y'all doing over there? <laughs> Done with that test rabbit gig. Man, when did downtown get uh, Trader Joe's? Well, you can't see it, but uh, yeah, Trader Joe's. How convenient is that for downtown? I'll definitely have to uh, check out Trader Joe's in the future. Nice, nice, nice. That wasn't the hardest thing in the world. Just knocked out that test rabbit gig, you know. I think I'm going to hit up this Chipotle right now. I'm on the hungry side, and uh, yeah, let's go get some Chipotle. At Chipotle, have another awesome meal. This is just um, a regular bowl with um, rice, beans, what corn, um, the, the hottest salsa, and the mild salsa, and lettuce on top. Let's dive right into this joint, just like I'm gonna dive into a swimming pool on a hot summer day. About that time now to jump on bar. Oh yeah, today's been a fun day. I mean, I made a little bit of money, got to hang out in the city. Got to uh, use another BART card because I have a whole bunch of these. This one's not working. I'm gonna have to go through this one. Let's try this one. I have a whole stack of these. But they all have like less than like a dollar of them. So I have to like, you know, upload money for like a trip and then use one. I have about 12 of these, by the way. Um, it's a long story. Anyway, what am I talking about? Falling asleep here. I almost back at the Airbnb. Somehow I accidentally, I don't know, something happened with Bart. But anyway, I'm almost back at the Airbnb. I'm about to pass out. I'm super tired. Bart took a whole lot longer than it should have. But uh, yeah, you guys probably know what happened. Well, I actually, I got on the train and I like passed out on the train and woke up and I was in like Dublin Pleasant. Woke up and I was in Dublin Pleasanton, which is really far away from where I was going. I had to take the train all the way from Dublin Pleasanton back to Daly City, which took, uh, I don't know, quite a bit of time. So now I'm walking back to the Airbnb and I'm gonna just pass out and edit this vlog tomorrow morning because I'm super tired and I'm thirsty. And yeah, that's how I'm gonna end this video. Thanks a lot for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.